Hey everybody, welcome into this new video. Into this tutorial, let's take a look how we can use the Google Sites to add some affiliate link and we can use this as a, uh, as a website, as a landing page. So it's gonna be really, really simple. And once you have successfully created a Google account, I mean, almost anybody has a Google account. If you do have an Android account, you must have a Google account. So you want to go into the site.google.com and in here, you can start to create your new site. So as you can see, I can choose a template gallery. And here you have work, small business, wedding, education, and much more. So if I don't want to start from scratch, I can go into, into the template gallery and I can choose whatever I want to do. If I want to go into the blank, I can just click in here. So uh, let's try to use blank because I think it's gonna be more easier to use something like this because you want to focus into a specific elements that you do want to see into your site. So as you can see, this one looks like a PowerPoint um, file. So what I want to do is to, let's say that, let's say I want to get your Amazon item here, like that. So what I want to do first of all is to understand how this site Google works. So here's my insert part. I can insert wherever blocks I want to do, or wherever I want to hear the pages. And I just want to focus into one. You don't have to worry about that. The themes. And I'm gonna go back into this one. I think this one looks good for me. And go into the phone style, and I'm gonna leave it like that. Actually, here into the insert part. This is the part what I. But well, this is really interesting. So here, I want to choose, for example, something light. So I'm gonna go into in here and choose light. All right, so it, it, it kind of looks more professional here, right? So what I want to do here is to start to chart, like this is a, a block, and I want to talk about a specific item. So for that, let's say that I have some affiliate links with Amazon. And here into Amazon, I want to go for something that I want to make affiliation. For example, I'm gonna scroll a little bit down and look for Kindle, for example, the e-reader of Kindle. So I'm gonna choose this option. I want to, of course, use my Amazon site tribe of the affiliate link. So what I want to do is to click into share. I want to use this file, this uh, link, go back into in here and what i want to do is to choose the placeholder like this and what i want to do is to leave it like that in here i want to go into upload and here into the upload i want to enter my image which that would be this one so what i want to do is to copy this image and here i can just go into upload and try to paste it right here i want to select an images here I want to go into Google Images, I want to look for Kendall, and I want to choose like the best image that I find here into my into my Google Images. For example, I try to use this one. Go into insert, and boom, here is my Kindle file. So what I want to do is to add a new text, uh, like this text box, just clicked in here, dragged that on the right part, like this and here let's say get your kindle with a special discount so I, what i want to do is to make this a little bit more big enough uh not so big maybe on the 28 something like that 24 i think it's fine 24 and then what i want to do is to of course add a button so here into this button i want to scroll way down here and look for a button that appears actually here. So here's the name of my button, let's say buy now. And here's the link, I want to paste the link that I used, my affiliate link, hit into insert. And then what I want to do is to move this in here. There we go, it looks much more interesting, right? Like this, so there we go. Now what I want to do is to make this and to align this and to the center part like this actually it looks really really great so what i think i need to finish my site this is for kindle discount enter site name 
candle discount. Uh, what I want to do is to change a little bit of colors. For example, as you can see, Amazon loves this color. So I want to do something related into that uh, brand colors. So what I want to do is to go into themes, go into this section. All right, so I think we got it. Get your Amazon item here. What I think that I can add here is like more text. Go into the table of contents or even go into the text box. Add this once again, put it down in here. And here to click to add text, what I just need to do is to copy and paste this information. I just need to change this into English, of course. Go into save some changes. Take my description of my Kindle or the thing that I want to affiliate. I want to paste it in here. It looks really, really great so far, right? So I think that uh, what I don't like a lot is the image. But I think I'm going to leave it like that and I'm going to add something more. So I'm going to hit into select once again. I'm going to hit into link. I'm going to paste this URL or if not, I can try to look for Kindle once again and look for something a little bit more professional like this one. For example, just going to try to look for something like that. If you already have your own images, that would be so much more easier. But in my case, I think I just want to stick around with the Google images and I want to move this on in here. There we go. So as you can see, if I move this, the other image is going to move, of course, at the same value as I do have here. So I just want to move this like this. And there we go. So lastly, if I want to add something else, for example, some counting blocks like this option, it's really easy to just add more and more images. You can select more images, hit into Google Images, do exactly the same thing, and I can add some more features about my product. But what is really, really valuable here is an affiliation um, website from site of Google, from Google Sites, is to, of course, insert the linked in here, for example, get your Kindle discount here, and I want to do exactly the same thing down in here. So once I do have like some more information like this, I want to insert like more text box like this, and here want to enter once again, get your 10% discount here to get your 10% discount. And I can add once again the image, I can just upload and we are just good to go. So once you finish in here, what I want to do, what I love to do after I finish to, to do all my work, of course, is to check it out how, uh, how it's going to be looking my final result. So what I just need to do here is to add an image of a candle file like this or even like this here and just verify that everything looks correct. And lastly, what I just need to do is to hit into publish. So here into publish, let's say I'm going to get uh, this count Kindle like this. And if my website has been taken already, it's going to be appearing something redder. But in the case, it appears as blue. So I'm going to hit into publish. And I'm going to hit into share. Copy the link and paste it into a new section. View publish site once again. And boom, here we go. Get your Amazon item here. It's looking really great, even though we just did it in less than eight minutes. So I just need to click into the links and see if it's working. So hit into buy now, redirecting into amazon.com. Boom, really, really easy, right, to do this. So there you have it, guys. It was a really, really simple tutorial. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more information and more tools for sitesgoogle.com. Thank you so much for watching the video, and I will see you on the, ne on the next one.